here's the very first thing I want you to do awesome. So you have your Trello account. And now you're going to create your first board. What you're gonna see in here is my board list. First, we're going to create a new board here. Click here. And then we're going to, to create a title or a project. Uh, let's say I create um, SMM or social media marketing board. And then create. Okay. Here, uh, so you're going to name it and title it whatever you'd, you'd like, something possibly to extent of your workflow. So what you're going to see here is Trello's greatest strength and also its greatest weakness. And this is where most beginner get stumped with Trello so you see a blank board and you're like what the heck am I supposed to do here and though Trello does have some great templates it's still intimidating to kind of create this from scratch so my intent here is to walk you through how Trello works and how you can set up entire system for yourself Okay, let's get started. Let's get started. The first the first thing you're going to do is you're going to create three different lists. And I promise you, you can customize this later on. Um we're going to we're going to create our first list. For example, we're going to create our our to do list to do and then enter and I'm going to create our doing list enter and we're going to create a done list and then enter and create a list here and so we're going to discard this this our three list where we have our to-do list and doing and we have done list. Mm -hmm. From from left to right, the things that you need to do will will go on this column and this column and from left we have we can we can move move this this move this guard card from from here or from here and then or we can set back here step back here The, the idea is that you're moving your task from left to right. The things that you need to do will go on on this column, right, and in this list. The things you're doing doing will then get moved to this one. And when you're done with a specific task or project, you can move it to the done list. So, you, for example, let's say today, I want to create a social media, let's say I want to create a social media, I sorry. So I want to create a social media graphics and then, or, and he, and, uh -huh, and then here I want to create, um, our, Captions, caption writing, and here 
want to create uh, example um Facebook ads. Facebook ads. Okay. From here. Okay. Social media. And then. Uh, are the three most important th things that I need to get done today, today as I'm doing them. Uh, for example, let's say, let's do in social media graphics and we can, we can, we can set up, uh, depending and depending on your workflow and you're going to moving your cards from the to-do to -do list to the doing list and to the done list. So now let's explore what cards are, are right. Each one of tasks represent specific cards and each card is located on a list. Uh, when we open this specific card, let's say that there's Additional step that I would like to uh, outline for this specific task, I can add here in the description and also have the awesome features like, for example, if you want to collaborate with a team, or example, we have a uh, social media, we have a description, we have to type in a description like example um social social media example benefits ben and then we can save on this uh, if you want to collaborate on your team or on your member you can click here or you can can create a name and you can put name here like um, example like can put like nervous I have no workspace member here so that they have no results to to see in here that's there is this. And if you want to make this, to make a labels, you can click here. Let's say um, image. You can create here and you see. There's a labeling label in here. And let's add some, let's say, um, hashtag, hashtags. You can see the labels here. Okay. And you can put here a checklist. Mm, can add our, a checklist. You see here, we have an item here. And an item, like, let's say, let's say we can add, um, should we grab, let's see, add an item is, the Facebook, Facebook cover. Okay. And then, um, say profile feature. And then, create the contacts. Contacts and then the about section. Okay. 
see the let's say we we can change here like social media social media optimization optimization i optimization and I'm saying here and uh, about section then the website if you're done if you're done in Facebook cover let's say here you can check Facebook cover and you can see the cross cross the across the line if you finish the Facebook cover and the means a profile picture and then the contacts. Okay, and you can set the dates here and let's say the dates is for example is tomorrow uh mm -hmm. Start the date tomorrow, let's say 8 a.m. You can change the time here. Okay. So one day before. You can select the time here. here. Nine or five minutes before, or fifteen minutes before. Let's see, let's select none, and then we can save. You see, you can see the dates here. Then when com check complete. If you complete this, and then let's say, and we have uh, an attachment here. We can paste the link of your photos or your image here, your social media graphics here. For example, okay, let's say in a camera uploads. Mm -hmm. You can select a files here. Let's say this image and you can select choose. You can see an image here in attachment. can create we can also create a cover here over and let's mm -hmm. let's search so let's search an image example um social media a social media social media you can select any photos here you want to select. Let's say this photo and click this image. And here. Here are our cover image. Then it's up. And you can you can create a comment here if you have a members, let's say 
they can they they you you want to see uh, the message on on this card inside this card let's say you leave a message you want to leave a message here you leave a message here here on this section and you can save it see here there a message in here you you want and then you can share this this card or this project to your group or members or your clients you can you can um click the share and then um you can save this link then you can send this to your to your clients or your members and if you finish this this uh this this project you can move you can move this card to here you can click this move and you can list these to to do or i to do ex to doing or you're done you're finished this you can check this you can click click doing or done if you're still doing you can select doing and if you're done you can click done here okay, let's mm -hmm. let's click uh let's say you can click the done and then we move move here let's see you can see that that in this uh, card, they move from left, move to right, our project, and then we can create, um, example here, the caption writing, uh, example, um, social media benefits, And then save. You can insert a hover here. Say, uh huh. Say, right, writing. Uh mm huh. -hmm. And then click here. Here are the photos, our cover photos. And then, and this, we can move here to doing, and then move. You can see that he moved already here on our doing and example our facebook ads um say the over let's put um over say facebook facebook ads let's see we can pick this any photos you can if you want any photos you can pick and close here you see the photos and then be sure to do and you can add the description and save and you can add the members the labels 
can put the labels and the checklist. And you can set the date, the due dates. And, and you can attach any piles. And files here from your Google Drive or your Dropbox you can attach any files, PDF files, like photos like, or any videos. You can paste any link here. And that's it. You can, you can share and move this. You can see this or to do and the doing and the done. It's easy to so we have our Trello done, our project management tools.